Hello and welcome to Rident's Game Night uh, with your host me, Rident, and tonight I'm playing Dynasty Warriors Extreme Legends. It's Dynasty Warriors 8 Extreme Legends, should I say. Um, so what I'm going to do tonight is showcase some of the new bits in the game um, that weren't in Dynasty Warriors 8. Um, have a look at some of the new scenarios and... Um, I think there's the there's the challenge modes and things like that. So I'm I'm gonna just gonna try and get you know do as much of the content as I possibly can, um, in the time being. Um, I'll probably stream for a couple of hours. Hurry, Lubu. Skip that. So what I'd say is first off, um, one of the brand new features that were introduced into uh, Dynasty Warriors Eight. Um, just before this launch was uh, but there was a patch update which uh, allowed you to import your save data so you can uh, you can store it online and from doing that you can then um, export the sorry, export the data from your PS from your original version of the PS3 the Dynasty Warriors 8 and then import it from that save data onto either this or Dynasty Warriors Extreme Legends um, complete edition on PlayStation Vita or PlayStation 4 and you can then do all, all of the story stuff that you've done so far will then be saved from the previous version and you can just carry on going forward with it on here um, with whatever extra features have been thrown into the extra characters and everything else they will be included within the story modes and the free modes etc um, I didn't get to spend as much time as I'd really hoped on Dynasty Warriors 8 in the time that it has been out, so I didn't end up finishing everything and I was kind of flickering between this version, the PlayStation 3 version and the, play, um, the Xbox 360 version, so I've done some story scenarios on the 360 and some on the PlayStation 3, so I've kind of tried to spend my time catching up since um, getting the Extreme Legends before I was doing this stream. Um, so you, you may notice there's some things which haven't really been unlocked and I haven't done as much the ambition mode uh, there's, there's actually an extra component to the ambition mode once it's completed so um, you can do some of the alter, um, the extra scenario bits on, on the ambition mode which um, weren't in the original version your character can level up to 150 as opposed to 99 I believe it was before um, so just a few minor things and there's the next tier of weapons, there's an extra difficulty level that was included um, as well as all these other bits. I mean the challenge mode is something which normally features in the Extreme Legends editions, um, Extreme Legends being an, uh, usually being the expansion to the original game and then you tend, um, it hasn't happened in every iteration but Empires is kind of the next stage where um, there's a lot more of the strategy involved, so the characters are kind of looking the same as they were in the in that series. So they look in the outfits and everything else in Dynasty Warriors 8 series, but there's a different kind of gameplay edge on the Empires, and a lot of people actually prefer the Empires um, strategy style to the Extreme Legends um, expansion stuff. Um, so I'll quickly just go through the options. Um, You'll see here, one of the new things which actually features on here is the data sharing. And data sharing will allow me to import and export data from uh, this game onto a cloud server. And then I can, if I've got a, I've got the uh, PlayStation 4 version of the Complete Edition or the PlayStation Vita version of the Complete Edition, I can then import that data and continue playing and do exactly the same thing on there. So once I'm done playing on there, I can then export the data back onto the cloud and then import it back on here. So it's a pretty cool little feature. I have actually got my PlayStation Vita to hand. Um, so you can just kind of see, um, let me just switch this on. Um, as you see, maybe uh, you've got exactly the same screen here. And you can just import the data, share it, and carry on with exactly the same game from exactly the same point wherever you go, which is which is a really cool feature. And if you're upgrading to the next gen, so if you're upgrading to PlayStation 4, um, it's perfect as ideal. So that's 
that feature. Um, the game crossplay as well. So if you go into network settings, um, you can go into matching settings. So you can either be on just the one platform or um, either of any platform. So same platform or any. Um, this allows you to play with people on the PlayStation Vita and the PlayStation 4. However, I understand that there are some issues at the moment with uh, matchmaking and online play. So once a patch has rolled out, which they did receive with the Japanese version, but because there are changes made to the software code on the English version, they then have to redevelop the uh, the patches. So they're not exact. As much as people like to say the patch is already out on Japan and everything else, there is differences. So we're just going to be patient with that patch to come out, and hopefully it comes out very soon. I mean, within the next week or so. Um, but obviously, I don't have any timelines for that. Um, let's see. For the sound, uh, standard stuff. The only thing that's missing in this list, which was on the other version following DLC, was the Japanese voice um, content, which some people, as I've seen, do prefer to play with the Japanese voices because they don't get on with the English voices or whatever. Um, personally, I've grown up with uh, Dynasty Warriors since Dynasty Warriors 2. Well, actually, I mean, did Dynasty Warriors 1, the fighting game before that, but Dynasty Warriors 2, um, Dynasty Warriors 2 through to 6 featured only English voices, and I grew used to those, so um, they, the, the English voices in this, does, it doesn't bother me. The only thing that does not annoying is there's a lot of empty spaces. Um, there's some of the dialogue which hasn't been um, fully... Uh, fully translated so it's just text on the screen and there's still no narrator which is kind of annoying but I mean hopefully going forward they do make the t you know do make those changes um, and that's pretty much your options so let's come out of here and So you get, uh, so you got your standard story mode, you get your free mode, ambition mode. Um, the addition here is the challenge mode, which you've got five different types of challenges. I believe it's five. So you got rampage, bridge melee, speed run, arena, and inferno. So each of these will offer a different, um, as you can see with the text in the middle there, um, they've got different uh, challenges within, it, within each different thing. So defeat as many enemies within the time limit, knock as many enemies off the bridge, um, go through the battle as fast as possible, defeat as, um, as many officers as possible, and rage through the battlefield like an inferno. <laughs> I have no idea what that is. I'm going to give that a test tonight. Um, have a look at your place, uh, personal best, you've got your online ranking system so you can have a look and see how you compare to your friends and other people. Um, so here we go. So there's your, uh, your ranking system and this is the world ranking I believe um, and you'll see your position at the top so I mean these are all the guys to uh, to play against just seeing what the um, so it's got single in brackets there I don't know if that's uh, single player and multiplayer in here I'm pretty sure before it was always single play only, um, but if they got multiplayer, the bonus. Oh, here we go. So team. So rampage as team. Bridge melee. Team. So that's that's pretty cool. Um, I'm not sure if that's online play or just uh, uh, split screen cop. But it's still good. So I'm going to come out of here quickly. Uh, 
gallery is pretty much your standard gallery but I'll just open up the menu you can just have a look at the first options I've unlocked a few, it seems um, so yeah basically you can see all the weapons, animals, movies, events etc um, you can see what you've got left to unlock so if you've still got things to unlock then you can go back and uh, do the various scenarios etc So let's come up here. As you see, I've got a nice Dinosaur Warriors 2 poster up here, which uh, was kindly donated to me. Um, come from the archives. Um, so, quickly go into story mode. Um, I've recent the, the last one I uh, things I've been doing was uh, Woo story mode. So. Because uh, that's the one that I've been doing on, I had been doing on the 360, and I hadn't actually finished it on here, as I realised. Um, the problem is, once you import your data from the PlayStation 3 version, um, you can't uh, um, import it again. So from the from the uh, vanilla game, so you can't um, import a second time, which is kind of annoying. So I couldn't. What I wanted to do was go back into the PlayStation 3 version, get those. Uh, trophies and then try and import the data again but it wouldn't let me. So this is the new story scenario we've got Lubu's story um, so we've got uh, various stages it's a relatively short um, story uh, story campaign but I mean the, you know there's still a fair few levels and there's still a good couple of hours or a few hours should I say of um, content here um, and especially you complete it once go back to the various uh, battles to um, achieve the, the little uh, those little stars up there from uh, fulfilling condi uh, conditions within the battlefield so then you can unlock this alternate scenario which is always cool um, if I go into say for example way select a stage now you can see this is the standard path this is what was included in the original game and this here, there's one of this. Uh, there's stuff like this for each of the kingdoms. There's, there's some additional scenarios, so some new battles which will feature in here. Um, and I believe this is what you need to go through to unlock some of the new characters in the game. And Wu, as you can see, is quite far behind. Um, but I've done as much as I could. <laughs> Uh, shoes complete. Jin has not even been started on this one, um, so I, that one I think it was Jin and Wu that I finished on 360, and the other ones I done on here. And because of that, I haven't actually got all the characters. So there's you know there's two more here left to get, um, and then there's a few extra. Uh, battles in here, so I think there's um, I think they're mostly ones with uh, Dong Shua. Well, I'm not sure what these two are yet. These three at the end are. I guess I have to play through and uh, and find them out. Right, so that's enough of uh, all the uh, the boring talk. Let's do some stages. Let's do a stage on Lu Bu's scenario. And what I could probably do, which one's that? Ding Tao. Um, I could do this, and you can see see the new character uh, Chen Gong in action, which I haven't got around to properly using yet. Uh, I, I did use him for a bit. And then I failed the stage because I didn't get around to. It. I wasn't watching what the battlefield was doing, and I failed to get the guy who was running away. Um, but I'm going to play as Chen Gong, and you can kind of see his new uh, playstyle. And yeah, I did do it in easy. I mean, I should do it a bit more difficult, but play it like this for the time being because I, I wanted to get a, 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 get through as much of the content as I could um, as quickly as I could uh, before I was doing tonight so I just 
ran through and easy and then when I redid the stages I went through and beginner just to blast through. Um, this is the, these are the sections which um, I'm on about which the, the missing the narrator which it feels kind of empty. Th there's actually one of the stages where it, there's no music at all and it just feels really odd. One of the complaints I'm seeing a lot of is the fact that they've changed uh, the voiceover for uh, Shang Chao and <laughs> it's annoyed a lot of people. Um, I personally don't find his voice that annoying, but I get you know I don't really play as that uh, play as him, so I, you know, maybe why? Um, but I'm not playing as him, I'm playing as you. So let's find your EX weapon, it'll be right at the bottom. My playstyle is normally um, playing with two of the same weapon. So I always use two of the EX weapons. So the EX moves are always available. And I kind of feel, uh, find it, it feels kind of wrong with them with two weapons um, different, you know, using someone else's weapons. It just doesn't feel right. Um, my usual ones on there. I don't know why I always use those. I, know, I just haven't got around to properly looking what the other ones are yet. Zeltiel's <laughs> army has already surrounded Lord Wuzo's unit. He won't last much longer. I understand. Wait, wait just a moment. This time, Cao Cao's defenses will be better prepared than they were at Puyang. In order to face his army, we must be ready. We have you, myself, and Zhang Liao. That's all we need. Yes, that is true. However, I believe we require... Therefore. We will simply scatter Cao Cao's army, just like we did last time. Yeah. At last, I can repay my debt to you. Here he is, comes striding in. I'll help Wu Zeng. You and your strategist go after Cao Cao. This will be a fight to remember. I imagine you're looking forward to it. Of course. Hmm. Let's go. It is time to show the land the strength of my army. Yeah! Okay, here I am. So, if I talk to him with the yellow. Um, that will be the alternate scenario and if I talk to the gatekeeper that's the standard scenario um, but one thing to note before I actually get started I have no room left for weapons so I'm not even gonna bother um, right now picking up weapons I'm just gonna leave it otherwise I gotta keep going um, and deleting, you know, dropping weapons or selling weapons, it'll just take forever. I'm not going to bother boring you with that stuff. Opening the gate! Here we go. Tao Tao, you still don't realize how overmatched you are! I shall 
keep beating you down until you do. Let's go. We will scatter Zhao Zhao's troops at Ding Town. Now, as you see, his um, his scroll. Come on, what are you waiting for? Let's get this fight started. <laughs> Unleashes a load of uh, ghost troops. And I actually like the scroll weapon, I think it's really cool. I hear there are many who are not pleased Ooh, with I should have gone up north. I think we should join forces with them in order to oppose him. I have no need for help from peons like them. Do not bother me with such pointless matters, Jet Gong. Why did nobody come to my aid? Is that simply what kind of man we do is? Has fallen. He'll be expelled from the city for sure. <laughs> They're pretty full of themselves by only capturing a single castle. We simply need to just take it back. We are playing right into the enemy's hands. I must devise a strategy to turn this situation around. Oops. I didn't actually want to use that then. Yeah. You are unstoppable. What are you waiting for? Let's get this fight started. I'm not going to stop. I'll let you go for now. Don't think you won. Okay, let's. Have a look at the other Musu moves. Um, bear with me two seconds. I'm just gonna have to pause and let someone in. <laughs> Give me two secs. Right, back. <laughs> okay, let's carry on. Well, actually, I want to go down there, don't I? Well, let's see what his next uh, Musu move is. I can more than hold my own on the battlefield. You think you can beat me? I must have 
last return. Nice. I am still able. I kind of get a concentration mode here, guys. Whenever I play this game. Now what I like about this is um, the fact that the archers don't stay as archers when you get close. Because those in the know will say that archers are the most annoying thing in the highest difficulty levels. I was a bit slow there, weren't I? Those worthless dogs! How dare they try to mess with me! I leave the rest up to you. I'm going to have your head! I'll let you go for now. Don't think you've won! Incredible. I am truly impressed by your skill. Well, that was hardly any trouble. I expected more out of Tao Tao's heart. My lord, an enemy raid has left the Allied main camp in flames. Oh, actually, that's another thing I forgot to mention. By the enemy. And that was... Ah, so this is what the enemy was really up to. We must hurry back to Ooh. Ding Tao. That was, um... Characters have now got two EX moves, it's not just the one. Someone's died in battle. I'm not doing very good, am I? I'm not concentrating as much as I should be. Probably focus our efforts on staying alive. 
Shu province in the southeast is ruled by this Liu Bei. Good. Let us fall back to there and regroup our forces. Master Lu Bu is struggling against Cao Cao. We must assist him until he can reach Shu. Time to have some fun! Cao Cao is stronger than I anticipated. Forgive me, Lu Bu. I'm afraid I cannot turn back this foe. Why? Why am I forced to retreat? Chen Gong, you are my strategist. Do something! That was my chance. Our main camp has already fallen. Master Lu Bu, there is little point in us continuing to fight. I knew they would be fleeing this way. However, they won't get any further. Now I need a decent place with loads Sao of enemies Sao so I can use the rage mode. He has even taken away our escape routes. This bit. Got about them. Gotta get those rock for us. You are doing an excellent job. We cannot allow our campaign to end in defeat. Everybody, now is our time to shine. Cao Cao has placed ambush troops up ahead here as well. Despite knowing that, we have little choice but to withdraw. I shall return after reviewing Gonna my Gonna go strategy. back here and rescue these guys. I can more than hold my own on the battlefield. Don't let them get away. Our orders are to not leave a single man left alive. You think you can beat me? Master Chen Gong was right about the ambush. However, we can't allow ourselves Not to fall here. Witness my splendor! You have no chance at victory. Surrender or die. Those are your only choices. Do not mistake my current predicaments while struggling with that. I'm simply giving you time to come in and finish them off. Oh! Such a splendid display of might! Well, where are you? You saw that I was in distress. Yes, I did. Trying to help me. What a clever creature! Very well done. It's kind of cute. I thank you. It's rather cute seeing you in action. Okay, I think these guys are pretty much saved. So let's get back to Lubu. Now. 
can more than hold my own on the battlefield. Time to have some fun. Did you really think you could get away? Not while I'm around. I believe there will be traps up ahead, but we must keep pressing forward nonetheless. Impressive! You are a true warrior of the Three Kingdoms! Incredible! I am truly impressed by your skill! There they are! Ready to rot! We'll crush them beneath us! Will this pointless trickery never end? It'll take more than that to stop me! So now to avoid these boulders. Oh, you realized I was in danger. I am sorry for burdening you. Because these guys in these games always like to use boulders. I'm going to have your head. I'm not going to stop. Just a little further until the escape point. Come, we must pick up the pace. I can more than hold my own on the battlefield. This should be good. Yes! Your deeds will go down in legend. I can't hold out much longer. I don't plan on letting you get away from us. In fact, this is the last battle you'll ever fight. This Surely this is our final obstacle. Once we break through them, we can finally escape this battle. Fine work! You're not too shabby! And uh, there we go. Impossible! I can't believe I lost to Zelzo! Why? Why can't I beat him? What's the problem? We just need to win the next battle. Yes, he's right. You should listen to him. Yan Province is nothing in the grand scheme of things. In these times of chaos, there will be endless opportunities for us to conquer the land. As warriors, we simply need to prepare our army to do better next time. Let's go. Remember this. One day, this entire land will be mine. So that's uh, that story scenario of Lubu's. Um, I'm not going to go through all the rest of his story, I mean that's something which you guys can do if you do pick up the game. What I will do now is go through one of the challenge modes, uh, or a couple of the challenge modes so you can have a look at what they're like. Um, so I'm going to do the that new one that I was thinking of, is it Inferno I think? Um, have a look at that, see what that's all about. I don't know if it's about the Rage Meter, because that was a new addition in Dynasty Warriors 8. Um, so that wouldn't have featured in Dynasty Warriors 7, XL, or 7. Um... Just wait for this to finish. Once this is, um done this is your little taster into the Lubu scenario um.
Now, Master Lu Bu, I leave you in charge. Hmm. Zhang Liao, when I return, let us share a drink together. Good luck, Master Guan Yu. Are you ready? This land is yours. Yours for the taking, my lord. We shall fight all the way to the end. Now, to seize the land for Master Lu Bu. Everything on the battlefield and make it my own. Right, so there we go. There's your taster into Lubu's story scenario. Um, I'm. I just realised where my uh, my webcam thing is pointing right now, and that's kind of blocking um, that. Whether it's the, the the HUD screen in the in the bottom corner, and I don't think there's anything in the top left, so I'm moving myself up there. So let's go into challenge mode. Let me select the course. Let's do Inferno. And change officer. Oh, I guess everyone's at level thirty. To keep it fair. Um So I'm gonna be my officer. So we're in vogue. Okay. Heaven on um Earth or Man. I'm gonna have heaven and earth. So I'm going to take this opportunity to change all the music and everything else. Um, but I'm not gonna. I'll accept whatever's given to me. So I guess the point is I've got to get around this whole map and kill everyone.
I'm not sure if I have to defeat everyone. Or just the officers. It's a bit of a strange map. Not used to having to jump over gaps. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to go around and... Uh, going to defeat the officers and see if that's what I have to do. Ooh, Sai Wenji. No! Last thing I want to do is bloody drop down the hole. you Peng Tong. Thing is I probably need that. Oh I should have just stayed on the bottom shouldn't I? Didn't realise there was a ladder on the other side. That's it.
and looks like I acquired a weapon. Unfortunately, I can't obtain it. There we go. So that's Inferno. Okay, return to battle preparation. I could have uploaded my score then as well. So let's choose a different course. Let's have... Do Rampage. I'm going to stick to Liu Bei as he's my kind of main character. Um, stick to the same weapons, etc. I assume they keep the weapons as uh, grade 3 for every single character just to keep things balanced and fair. This is a pretty good move for Look, it's a Lubu. I like this challenge. Okay, the back to the rotating enemies.
I think I'll use Rage Mode in the next time. Lubu again. That's a good rampage. <laughs> Beat Lubu.
challenge complete. <laughs> Our bit mental. Yay, new record by me. First time playing. <laughs> uh, doo -doo -doo. Rampage Master. And uh, do you got a slasher? It's the second time I got one of those wheels. We could do something better. I don't really use um. Thing. Whatever his name is. Lee Diane or whatever. Um. So that's Rampage. Rampage is fun. Again, I could have uploaded my data, but I didn't. Uh, select course. A bit bridge melee. So I gotta try and beat uh, a thousand. Let's begin. And if you notice, there's another new thing on there which is the leadership skill, which I believe you need to do ambition mode to earn leadership skill. <laughs> yeah. Let's start over. No good at bridge melee. Let's give it one more shot. I want to lock myself up as well.
And I got a nice crappy new bow. Which I'm not going to keep. Quit with that with too many weapons yet. Okay, let's return to battle prep. And let's do a arena. Arena should be fun. And then I'll go back into doing some of the um, story style scenario things. I think story modes are more fun. I might do um, story scenarios with Shu, so the alternate story scenarios. I shall measure the extent of your abilities in battle. My army moves forward. Next challenger, please. So, you wish to join the elite? Then you will have to prove that you belong. My move forward. But it takes ages for them to spawn out, doesn't it? Bring everything you got! 
Ooh, weapon gem. Come and face me if you're so confident in your strength. Whoa. Evaluate the skills that you claim to possess. Come on. Shang Chuna. Not that you have a chance against me, but I'm curious nonetheless. Oh, I noticed the health bars had suddenly ramped up.
damn, damn, damn. So what I'm going to do is I'll finish off uh, this evening with one final one final battle, which will be hmm, I don't think I need a stallion cleaver. Although that uh, Right, I'm ranked number 43. <laughs> um, so let's let's quit this and let's go into the story of scenarios. Now I'm going to do my favourite story of scenario and go into shoe. Let me select a stage. Do this new one here. So I can be uh, Xiaoyun, uh, Shang Fei, or Guan Ping. Let's give this a quick read while uh, it's loading up. I would read it out as a narrator, but. I can't read it as, and say it as quickly as it comes up on the screen, so you just kind of have to bear with it. Looks like we're finding an escape room. Uh, who do I want to be? Hmm. I might be Xiao Yun. Poster boy. Where the hell have you got a war fan? Alright, let's do this one quick and then uh, I'll finish off the stream. Um, while this is playing, I'll quickly stink stick the links so you can follow our uh, channel um, so you can follow us on Twitter at we are gamers or you can follow uh, <sighs> like, up like us on Facebook or however you want to say it um, www.facebook.com forward slash we are gamers so links will be at the bottom there first we need to capture that base occupied by Tao Tao's army 
Understood. I shall capture the base as per your instructions, Master Shu Shu. Let's have a look at Officer Info. Oh, Triangle Triangle will do. That's his new EX move. Another obstacle in the path of justice has fallen before me. Get these guys. Tao Tao's main unit is almost here. It is a race against time for us to finish making the necessary preparations. To come out alone like that. Utter troops within the base we just captured. That will serve as the launching point for our attack against the main unit. Okay. I must fall back. Another obstacle in the path of justice has fallen before me. You brought me reinforcements? Well, I still won't be defeated by this lot. Come on, what are you waiting for? Let's get this fight started. It appears that we have captured the base. Now to find a suitable place to hide ourselves. This ends now! Let's get these three bases. last-ditch attempt at escaping certain death? Well, it's not going to do them much good. my strength! I must return while I am still able. Now! Another obstacle in the path of justice has fallen before me! One, so one more. Hey, it looks like they're moving to the attack now. You know, this is one cornered rep that I'm not really worried about. I shall own the battlefield. Not that I can see any of that attack. Just not my day. I'll come back again when I'm feeling better. Another obstacle in the path of justice has fallen before me. We cannot be defeated here. Whoa, Guan Ping. You brought me reinforcements? Well, I still won't be defeated by this one. No choice but to fight. Do not let this opportunity to slay him get away. 
Ah, oh, too late. That's enough of placing the ambush troops. Now, we must lure the enemy's main unit to the ambush. Draw the enemy in and lead them to the center. Little Bay has moved to attack. I had better keep an eye on them. Unbelievable! I've never seen such strength! I did not think I would be receiving any reinforcements. Let us turn the tide. to move forward without being noticed. There is something suspicious going on in the center. All units, do not let the enemy lure you into a trap. No! My carelessness has led to the failure of our plan! Well, well I didn't even have anyone there in the middle. One. They will need me in the next fight. I'm sorry, if that is all for today. Another obstacle in the path of justice has fallen before me. What's the matter? Are you lost, you poor little thing? We cannot hold out for much longer. Every option at my disposal. We may not be able to make it through this. The enemy is defending this position well. I am grateful for your help. Perfect timing. I was looking for an opportunity to test my new tactics. You brought me reinforcements? Well, I still won't be defeated by this one. Come on, what are you waiting for? Let's get this fight started. I shall return after reviewing my strategy. Another obstacle in the path of justice has fallen before me. I'll let you go for now. Don't think you've won. Unbelievable. I've never seen such strength. Before me, I shall return after reviewing my strategy. 
Come on. Not be able to make it through this. Yeah, all my troops are dead. I think I fucked up that strategy. Pray to my tactics. Listen to my strength! It is impossible for an army to continue fighting on an empty stomach. Another obstacle in the path of justice has fallen before me. I'll return after reviewing my strategy. Hang on, is that another officer down there? We cannot hold out for much longer. For warriors, these guys are pretty pants. Take me. The men of the Soon family what? refuse to go quietly. I own the battlefield! We cannot afford to fall here. Everybody, retreat! Who the hell is Lu Bay up against? My devotion and commitment have taken me to the top. Unbelievable. I've never seen such strength. Yeah. Oh, you realized I was in danger. I am sorry for burdening you. I think I need to just get up there and win that battle. I think screwing up that tactic at the uh, beginning was a bit of a pain in the ass for me.
they're resorting to brute force. It is obvious that Liu Bei's army lacks a capable strategist. Then you come to the right foot. This cannot have happened. Not to me. So they're resorting to brute strength without any hint of strategy. That will not do them any good. Hear the We have driven off Cao Cao's army. It was all thanks to everyone's efforts and Shu Shu's strategy. Well, it wasn't thanks to Shu Shu's strategy because I fucked that up. <laughs> um, that's me messing up a mission and not following orders. And that is also the end of my stream. So thanks to all who've taken the time to sit and watch and uh, join in the session. Um, I'll be back next week. Um, I'm supposed to be doing Titan for as a community session. Um, I haven't yet picked it up, so I'll have to wait and see if, if things change. Then I will obviously update the uh, the schedule and stick Titan Fall as another night. Um, if you follow the links at the bottom of the screen right now, um, you can uh, follow us up on Twitter and everything else and. Uh, subscribe to the channel this will also go up on YouTube um, in the coming days maybe even tonight and I think that's about it so yeah stick with us we are gamers um, I've been Rident and thanks for watching <laughs>